Central Luzon region of the Philippines. The pageant seeks to empower women to become advocates for consumer rights and to educate their communities about making informed purchasing decisions. So, nagkaroon po ng mga qualifications na kung saan aware ang ating mga iba't ibang DTI provincial offices at mga consumer groups dahil sila po ang naghanap ng ating mga contenders or contestants. And then, for the flow of our competition in here, magkakaroon po tayo ng introduction part, magkakaroon din po tayo ng talent competition, we have the creative costume competition, and the question and answer portion. Pero may narinig ako, swimsuit? May request ba kayong swimsuit competition? <laughs> Pwede next year, hindi po ba? Yan pa ang isa sa mga gagawin natin challenge for next year. Pero for now po, okay na muna tayo doon sa creative costume na ipapakita nila sa atin. Alright. So, eto po ang ating mga magiging criteria for judging sa ating uh, Miss Central Luzon Consumer Advocate 2024. So, we have for costume and creativity, that is 30%. Knowledge of consumerism, 50%. Siyempre, yung pinakamataas. At yun ay masusubok mamaya doon din sa ating question and answer portion. Appearance and projection, paano nga ba silang mag-ganda-gandahan dito sa harap, yun ay 10%. At ang kanilang talent ay also good for 10%. So that makes a total of 100%. Ayan. At syempre, meron din po tayo mga tumataginting ng mga papremyo sa ating mga mananalo na kanilang pinaka-aabangan. So ngayon, may pakilala ko naman po sa atin ang ating mga judges who would be helping us in determine our winner later on. They will also serve as our judges for our uh, our selection committee no for our spoken poetry competition so first she is uh, he is a senior research specialist of the Banco Central ng Pilipinas North Luzon Regional Office kasama po natin si Mr. Dennis Gundran Susunod po ay uh, syempre hindi iba sa atin our very own Subtids ng DTI Region 3 from the Business Development Division at dating kasamahan sa Consumer Protection Division, Mr. Jose Antonio Toledo IV, Sir Jojo. At kasama rin po sa iisang bubong ng Consumer Protection Division, kaya alam na alam din ang ginagawa ng CPD from the Intellectual Property Satellite Office ng Region 3, Mr. Barry Marcelino. Ayan po, ang ating mga nagagawa po ang mga judges, sila po ang ating kasamahan. Siyempre, upang magbigay ng mga marka, base po dun sa nabasa po natin criteria for judging kanin-kanina lamang. So now, handa na po ba kayo makilala ang ating mga kandidata? Para mahina pa ang inyong hiyawan, handa na po ba kayo? Alright, so ladies and gentlemen, mukhang kinakabahan sila. Kung kinakabahan kayo, para kinakabahan din na ito ang ating mga magagandang mga dilag na nandito sa ating libran. They're very much ready, of course, to showcase and to show you what they got. Ladies and gentlemen, live at Walter Mart, San Fernando, this is the Miss Central Zone Consumer Advocate 2024 as we meet our candidates presenting and introducing themselves one by one. Palakpakan po natin sila.
ating mga panahulit. Magandang araw. Ako po si Gina Annalyn and Raya ng Bataan representing uh, affairs ng Bataan. 52 years old. Naniniwala po ako na ang walong Good morning po sa inyong lahat. Morning. Gulat kayo lahat, no? Kasi, I did not expect this. Yes. I'm Aurora 
to Nana Fowler representing Pampanga. My motto in life, Matalinong mamimili kasi hindi po ako marunong mamili. Bakit? Eh di naman po ako pumimili kasi alas karamihan, bigay lang. Branded na ba? Shows everything, puro bigay. Kasi, God created the most beautiful girl in the world all of you. Very handsome, but I'm the most beautiful of them all. Yeah. 68 years old at present. I am the senior president of my place, Barangay Alasas, and I'm here to announce you that I'm the number one. I'm the most beautiful girl among the 36 senior citizens because I'm the letter A. That's all. Thank you. <laughs>
gentlemen, it's Tabitha.